And he would say to them, just be happy, just get on with it. You know, many people do that. It's a very common thing to do. Many men still don't even see that they have an emotional need. They laugh it off and um, push it aside just because of the fear of the unknown. This is so common. Stormzy, he says it well in his recent album, Heavy is the Head, an amazing album I must add. As soon as I picked it up, couldn't put it down. <laughs> Welcome to Decipher a Rapper, a part of the MAMA platform, Men and Mental Health Awareness and the Tortured Superhero. I'm going to be talking about a particular superhero who I think is slightly tortured, Stormzy. Anxiety and depression are no respect of person, okay? Um, creed, position or type, young men suffer daily and Stormzy was one of them and possibly even still suffering. In a past interview, he talks about how he had dismissed friends in the past who had depression and he would say to them, just be happy, just get on with it. You know, many people do that. It's a very common thing to do. Many men still don't even see that they have an emotional need. They laugh it off and um, push it aside just because of the fear of the unknown. This is so common. Stormzy, he says it well in his recent album, Heavy is the Head, an amazing album I must have. Ad. As soon as I picked it up, couldn't put it down. In my view, this says it all for mental health adaptations and understandings. Heavy is the head. And often, we are propped up by fake confidence and gimmicks and escapism, drugs, sex and alcohol. Many men do participate in escaping their own emotional needs. The expression of his own emotional development and hang-ups portrayed throughout what I believe is an epic artistic spill of a young man's plight with himself, the world, and his own sense of self. Rachel's little brother. I bottle up and then I spill it to my therapist It's not a healthy way of living but we living still Trying to fill empty voids up with seven figure deals Sertraline and nicotine, I hit it till it heals What may not be noticed here is this is a huge insight into his mental psyche. It is huge because he says a lot in this particular track. He says a lot in all of the tracks, but this one really stuck out for me. It proves the point that men do bottle up their emotions. You know, they bottle things up. Stormzy, one man, but does speak for many. He does. Just because a person is appearing to um, have success does not mean they are without negative impact of mental health and emotional disturbance. It's no respect to person. Anybody can have a mental emotional disturbance. The beauty in this track is the promotion of getting help. I do love that factor. He doesn't just dismiss the fact. He doesn't, you know, self-medicate. He doesn't talk about trying to get past the emotion by buying things which is why this album stands out for me um, with a few other British artists out there but this one really does stand out for me he talked about going to see a therapist and um, that is stated when he says I bottle up and then I spill it to my therapist uh, it's not healthy way of living but yeah that's what he does because this is the way out for him this is how we can find some kind of peace so um, why are so many men bottling things up? What is the actual problem? And how can we help? Well, he has another track. There's so many tracks. The album is very heavy. Um, he talks about it in one second. One second. And what I really, um, I really like about this track is um, he gives us a clue. And he says, it just takes just one second. Just ask, have a conversation. One second, just let me be. Let it pour, let it rain, let it bleed Heavy is the head but the pressure makes you heave So you build it cause the spirit of depression never sleeps And I am not the poster boy for mental health I need peace of mind, I need to send self The cover of the enemy, that shit made me resent myself There's people trying to spread the word and people that pretend to help I would say it takes more than one second But the notice that he gives to the recognition that a conversation and time is necessary for me 
is so adequate and so necessary for so many young men suffering across the world with their own emotional needs. Mama is all about giving men a platform to be recognised, nurtured and understood when it comes to their emotional needs and uh, this does it in recognition for the fact that there's a need for it. Um, in one second, he says, heavy is the head, but the pressure makes you heave. I see so many young men dealing with day-to-day -day life who just can't deal with the pressure, the fact that they've got to live up to so many standards and they're not sure if they, they're going to make it. They're not sure if they can. Um, he says he's not the poster boy for mental health. I argue, I argue that he could be and probably should be and probably will be after this album. Uh, he talks about needing peace of mind and, and he needs to be centered. And I say, uh, no such thing as peace of mind. There isn't. The only thing is con unconditional self acceptance and acceptance of others. And that will create a natural calm. But peace is for death. Life is not peaceful. We live every day and we move, we have ups and downs, we flow between, and um, at times it can be boring, at times it can be calm, but it won't always be peaceful, because that wouldn't be life, you wouldn't be alive. The cover, he talks about being the cover of a magazine, he said that this made him resent himself, and this particular lyric I found quite poignant, because um, there are so many people who achieve success and don't believe that they deserve it. This self-loathing is common, and common amongst men. The feeling of not deserving triggers so many men towards suicidal thoughts and acts and ideas about how they can just get past the fact that they don't believe that they deserve. So how do we support young men like Stormzy? Men like Stormzy. Just like he says, to just give them a minute, talk, listen, understand, allow that person to be themselves without judgment, being aware of how we place gender bias and roles on others and how much of a stress that can be for them, recognising our own behaviour in order to support another person. An amazing album, Heavy Is The Head. Um, it's worth every second of listening time, every single track, every single track. There's not one track on there that I skipped, listened to it over and over again. And um, it talked a lot about emotional pain. And it highlights the fact that um, rappers feel emotional pain too. What was, um, what for me, what stood out was how honest he was in this rap. It wasn't, it wasn't about having cars and girls and money and looking good and driving around and feeling hard. It really came from the heart, poetically done, as rap, I believe, should be. It's about poetry. It, he is lyrically a genius in what he has done with this album and it has really opened up so much for young men to be able to rise to the platform and accept themselves and actually start having the conversation. So this is about rappers deciphering the rapper. I will be doing more on this segment and talking about more rappers who um, are suffering with their own mental emotional well-being and in support and in need of help and how it links to young men Thank you so much for watching. My name is Desiree Shaw. If you are having emotional issues yourself and you want to take control, you can go to the website and fill in the uh, questionnaire on, on anxiety, depression, anger, jealousy, stress. Find out how your mental health is. And once you've filled in the form, fill in your email details and join the mailing list, the newsletter because it's all about you now. And you now is a weekly newsletter that will be delivered to your inbox, giving you hints and tips and direction on how to get past anxieties and depression and deal with relationships and conflicts and manage life. Hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification button so that you are notified. We put these videos out on a Monday and a Wednesday. I podcast on a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. So make sure you get your fill, your mental wealth fill. I'm on a mission to make therapy accessible and change the world one thought at a time. Thank you so much for watching. See you on the flip side. There's a rain done. It's Desiree here, and my rap name is. What was it called again? It was. We did something here. Delicious D.
done. <laughs> no. Actually, no. My rap name is Desiree Shark. <laughs> MC Desiree Shark. Desiree shouldn't. Desiree mustn't. Desiree could. <laughs> You gotta guess this track. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh. But have you got the track? Have you got it? Have you got it? Ooh. This is a bad track. Pop for it. 